Good morning, everyone. This is Janae Elkins with the National Weather Service, and I will be conducting you all's weekly weather briefing. So a couple of highlights. Today, we do have some severe weather potential. We're more so tonight going into tomorrow morning. Um, dry weather will return to the region after Tuesday, and the next possible chance of rain will be this weekend. So let's talk about Monday night, which is tonight, and going into Tuesday morning. We do have two different risks that is out. Um, we have a slight risk and we have a marginal risk. Um, with these risks, um, we're expecting damaging wind gusts up to 60 miles per hour, hail size up to a quarter size, and a tornado can't be ruled out in any of these counties or this area. And as far as timing, we're looking at for things to kick off Monday night, uh, mainly after midnight and going into early Tuesday morning. So today there is a warm front that is way south of the state and we also have a high pressure that is north of the state and the high pressure will help to suppress any severe potential for this afternoon. But we can't rule out a light to moderate shower in any uh, parts of the region today as moisture continues to be on the increase throughout today. Going into tonight, the warm front kind of lifts up just a tad, and as it um, continues to surge northward, um, this will give um, the region the lift that it needs to increase severe thunderstorm potential in the overnight hours tonight. So going into Tuesday, the severe threat will continue to push east by Tuesday afternoon. Um, it will leave behind light showers and... Um, by the evening hours, this will be, um, everything will be out of here, will be gone. So after Tuesday, we are looking into some good weather, some dry conditions. Our next chance of rain possibly will be Saturday mm -hmm. as there is a, a, um, a cold front and associated with that cold front is a surface low. Um, models still kind of disagree as far as timing and as far as maybe exact locations of where the rain will fall but we'll continue to update you guys um, on a day-to-day -day basis with that so looking at a total seven day precipitation we're not expecting much we're not expecting for these to be um, a heavy rainfall event um, or anything like that it is possible we may get up to an inch over the whole course of the seven days um, but with that um, being said, we're not expecting any major flooding or anything like that. So to conclude, again, we do have severe weather um, tonight going into tomorrow morning. Tomorrow morning being Tuesday with the main threats being damage and wind gusts up to 60 miles per hour. Um, possible hail up to a quarter size and a tornado cannot be ruled out. After Tuesday, dry weather will, be will return to the region and come... Um, Saturday that will look like to be our next chance for possible rain and with that thank you for viewing this presentation